Before starting this tutorial, make sure you have a copy of Halo Map Tools, Photoshop, and the NVIDIA DDS plugin that goes with Photoshop. For this tutorial, I will be explaining on how to make a skin on Halo. First of all, start up HMT and open a map. All the maps in the Maps folder are linked to the same bitmaps file. If you did a normal install on Halo, your Maps folder should be located in C, Program Files, Microsoft Games, Halo, Maps. I'm going to open bloodgulch.map. Now find the little bitmap branch. Expand the branch and locate a bitmap that you want to change. For this tutorial, I will use the Banshee Texture. Take note of the texture information over on this side. This bitmap is DXT1. This information will become useful later in the, the tutorial. This information will become useful later in this tutorial. Click Save Texture and save it somewhere you can find it. For example, your desktop. Now start up Photoshop. Open the DDS file that you exported from HMT. For me, it'll be located on my desktop. Now comes the fun part. Find a picture that you want to add to the texture. For example, we'll use a watermelon. Why not? Take the watermelon, right click it, go to copy, then go back to Photoshop. Now in Photoshop, go to edit, and then hit paste. Your image is now on top of the DDS picture. Now we want to place it where little logo can go. You grab it by the handles and you can resize it. After this you can go to the little check mark symbol to make sure it's okay and then it'll place it there on the image. Now you may not want all that white around that box so grab this little button the magic wand tool and select all the white in the image then hit delete. Now it's just a little watermelon. You can move it around to make sure it fits. But now to export, you can't have two layers like Photoshop normally supports. So what you have to do is go over here to where it says Layer 1, right click, and go to Merge Visible. This makes it all one layer and puts everything that's visible on the image as one. So now we have a texture of a banshee with a watermelon on it. Well that's cool, now we have to get it back into Halo. Let's go ahead and save this file now. We're going to go to File, and then Save As. Now we're going to save it as Banshee 2 instead of Banshee 1, so we can still go back if we ever have to. Hit Save. New window will pop up. On this window it will ask you what type you want to set the file as and in HMT it told you that it was a DXT1 so we'll choose that and then hit save make sure when you're done saving that the file type is really a DDS and not like a DDS1 or a DDS2 you just want it dot DDS okay so let's close Photoshop and go into HMT we're still here at the Banshee area. We will inject the new texture Banshee2.dds. Hopefully, if nothing has gone wrong, it'll say texture was successfully imported. Now you can see that my watermelon is there in the texture, so it obviously has worked. Now all you have to do is close the map file and start up Halo.
go ahead and hurry up with Caleb. Create a match. And then start. Let's go see if our new texture actually works. Success! There's a watermelon on the banshee.